guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be working on the air brake manifold that we started in the last video where we installed the AC evaporator unit in the cab of the truck. I also noticed we have a few new subscribers on channel, so welcome. If you haven't already subscribed, go ahead and click the little subscribe button. You will get more LMTV stuff in your timeline. And I try to make about one video a week, uh, usually a little less if the weather's nice. But uh, I know you didn't click on this thumbnail to get a screen full of this. So without further ado, let's just jump into it. So we kind of lucked out. We have two reservoir inputs and we have one supply line air. So we had to make a little T-fitting that comes around here, but this loop actually fits around the wiring harness. And then this thing slides right down in. So it should be pretty good. So now all we got to do is feed the rest of the lines around and feed them up through here and we'll start cutting them to length and then uh, putting the uh, compression fittings back in here and we'll get uh, see if we can get this thing working. It is going to go for this top and the supply air is going to be the bottom, trailer is on the other side, so that's going to be the second longest. Park there for the tractor and then supply. Okay, so supply can be this long no longer, so we'll cut that sucker right there. Side of the wiring. Let's see. All right, let's start with the bottom and work our way to the top. Okay, so air supply. This long. What did I do? Ah, oh, cutter. <laughs> All right, cutter. Take 27. Air supply is longest. You think I could read? It's this trailer right there. My gosh, I am ridiculously dumb. Entire bag for one stupid barrel. That's not stupid, it's just. I believe I had to buy a $9 bag of ferrules for one. But I wasn't willing to wait. <laughs> That's why I have extras. Now 
let's leave that thing out until we air the truck up and see if it leaks like a sieve before we bolt that in. There's an air bubble. Okay. Let's get a spray bottle full of uh, soapy water and we'll see if any of these fittings are leaking and might be good to go. <laughs> no bubbers. Cool. Good. And now our brake manifold is a lot cleaner. All right, now comes the fun part. Oh, this is much stiffer when it's aired up. <laughs> the supply air is too fracking long. Is too long by about an inch. <laughs> All right, let's drain the air tanks. Ah, that didn't seat worth the crap. This was probably pushed out. Shit. Okie dokie, we has brakes again. Ta da. Now you might be thinking to yourself, hey, didn't he just put that trailer supply system in and that was already all put together? Well, it was until I started putting the CB radios back on. I thought, hey, you know what would be good? Be able to clip it right here. So I started putting the clip on this bolt here and the rib nut decided to take a wander to start spinning in place. So I'm going to have to drill this out and put a new rib nut in. So in this episode, we managed to get our brake manifold installed, fix my little problem with the uh, <laughs> busted nut there. <laughs> no, no pun intended. I also drilled a hole through the side here to punch a grommet in so we can run the cabling instead of running it down underneath and getting that all gunked up. So Alex made a good point. Anytime you drill a hole in metal, always shoot it with some primer or, well, at least here I color match the paint, but before you put a grommet in there. So thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one. Now, I know I said I put that uh, bungee cord in there to hold maps and stuff, but it holds a work light really well, too.
Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Forgot what we were going to talk about. <laughs> Rake Masters. Ding, ding, ding. Boop. Set it. Uh. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be working on the Air Brake Master Disputy Blue Thingamajigger. The Manifoldy Boopy. Okay. Son of a fajinaba. Today, and hey, text messages in the middle. It was important. It's talking about needing up to go to the bar. So, you know, important work things. <laughs> okay. Oh, gurgle. My God. Got a giant head. Never give me something I can see myself in. This is just terrible. Let's 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 decide what we want to do off camera and then we'll record this intro. 